Right, so I'm at the food show. I've got Josh Emmett in front of me. We've just watched his demo, which is absolutely fantastic. So we're going to talk to Josh now. So how's it going? Good, Mark. You know, how are you? Yeah, good. I'm great. So you've got two kids, a wife, six restaurants. Like, yeah. How do you find the time to you know, divide yourself amongst all that? You need to map out your time really well. Yeah. So, I, you know, I, I do a lot of stuff myself. I have, I have a PA who manages a little bit of my time, manages my calendar. Then you you concentrate on having good staff throughout the restaurants, and we have a you know we have a restaurant uh, manager and a chef who are responsible for each individual Very restaurant. restaurant. And you you know what it's like, you know, yeah. if they're doing their jobs properly as they should be, I can do my job properly. Yeah, um, right, exactly. So yeah, I've got two kids and wife, one restaurant, yeah, and it's yeah. It's, I forgot it's about the two hard. kids and wife. Should we talk about that? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so food trends. What what food trends have we got? I noticed last year there was a lot of. Um, you know, burning stuff and charcoal and stuff. Yep. We're in 2016 now. Any any food trends that you can see or implementing? New Zealand's still at a point where it's um, you know we're, we're, it's still quite worked food, yeah. but overseas it's very much food is simple, extremely simple, a lot simpler than people think. I, I think and, and kiwis, I think kiwis, um, home cooks and that sort of thing, actually really good cooks. So simplicity. You go to restaurants in London. I went to um, you know Flatiron recently, and all that they do is serve steak. Flat iron steaks and chips and some salad and that is it and it is ram. You find more and more concept to focus focus on um, single items or single products or and, and a small element of products and I think that's one of the big trends that's happening overseas. So you got four Madame Woos, yeah, Queenstown, Hamilton, Takapuna and Dunedin. Yeah. Any any plans for more? Yeah, definitely. Why not? You know, we we, we built Madame Wu. You know, you can't. Build it. You can build it with that idea in mind, you mm -hmm. know, and you never know what you're going to get. I don't think. You know what it's like with the restaurants. You, exactly. Yeah. Uh, people treat them like they want to treat them sometimes. Um, and you know, Madam, where the price points right, good value for money. I think we got so much of the the ideas and the concepts right, and it's such a great cuisine that it is so so Malaysian, so versatile. Yeah. You know, so you can go in there for a, a snack, a banquet, a hawker roll, for a full blown full menu meal. to celebrate whatever you want. Um, so. Yeah, we want to open a few more. Definitely. Um, definitely. Why not? Yeah, exactly. Why not? And I've got a suggestion. Yeah. What about Pocono? <laughs> Pocono? Is that where you've moved <laughs> yeah, to? Yeah. Yes. I need one there. Uh, Hamilton? You're in between Hamilton. You could choose yeah, Hamilton or Auckland, couldn't you? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So we're the cafe. So yeah. we've got, devised a special game. So it's called the Espresso Quick Fire Round. Yeah. So I'm going to ask you questions. And then I want the first answer to come into your head. Yeah. You ready? Yeah. This could be offensive. That's fine. That's what we want. <laughs> no. Favourite swear word in the kitchen? Uh, no, I can't repeat what I, what I hear in the kitchen because it's just so shocking. You know what I mean? I know what you're talking about. Yeah, we won't, we won't say that one. Chef hat in or out? Uh, no, good. Good for New Zealand. Favourite New Zealand ingredient? You know what? I, I'm slightly biased, but clams. Those Cloudy Bay clams. I've got to say, you know, there's some, I think they're the, one of the best ingredients in New Zealand. You know, it's, hard, it's a funny one to pick because it's, you know, it's not widely available. We, we have amazing access to it. Yeah. I think they are hot ingredient and in should be on every menu and, and and they are very widely around New Zealand but they are gorgeous. Mm, they are. If they were in France they would be everywhere. Be. Favourite European ingredient? Favourite European ingredient are uh, sweetbreads from um, Holland. Mm. Oh my bloody oh, god. Nice. Hey. That's what we need over <laughs> here. What kitchen utensil would you be in the kitchen? Uh, knife of course. Sharp to the point. <laughs> good. <laughs> good. That's awesome. Thank you very much, Josh. Good nice to see, to see you, you, mate. Thank Always you. good to see you.